Hey guys, today we're gonna be having some shawarma and some falafels. And then there's like some salad, fries, all that jazz. I haven't had shawarma in a very long time and I love shawarma. There's not a lot of food that I hate in life, but shawarma is one of the dishes I love. So let's go ahead and eat it. Take a bite. Oh my gosh, this is gonna be divine. Look how big this guy is. Okay, look at the difference. It's huge. It's like if my arm is a foot, then it's about a foot long. But first, I want to show you the deets as always. All right, so this is the falafel salad with fries. And then this is the falafel. It's huge. Let me, let me see if it will come apart a little. Oh no, they did a good job wrapping it up. But that's the falafel, guys. It's huge. And I don't know where I got this information from, but I heard that falafels and like tacos like come from the same background. So interesting. But look at this lamb in there, guy. There is lamb at the entrance. Looks like there's some yogurt, dill yogurt, jalapeno yogurt. Let's take a bite. Oh. Mmm, so good. Look at that. Mmm. Mmm. The red raw onion and pickled red onion in here. It's so good. It like kind of breaks apart from the fat so it can get like oily, but that pickle aspect is doing something. Mmm. I also have kyoste, mm -hmm. like that meatball in there. So it's lamb and the kyoste meatball. There's tomatoes, lettuce in here. So good. Mm. So good. But let's get some gokushiro. Oh, it splattered me in the face. I'm just going to... I'm just gonna go with it, all right. It sounds so refreshing. Almost like waves at a beach, is that weird? All right, for those of you who are interested in what I ordered, this is what I ordered. Let's try a falafel. Falafel is mostly made out of chickpeas. So let's try that out. Good. I will say though, it is a bit dry. So you have to eat it with all the yogurt on the side on top of the salad or fries, whatever you get. Mm. This is huge, guys. Mm. And then there's some lamb in there, lettuce, fries, onions, tomatoes, yogurt. It's divine. It really is showstopper amazing. Mm. When it gets a little too dry, not that, you know, they did a bad job at it, but when it gets a little dry, just use some more yogurt. You can just drizzle it on top. Every day I'm drizzling. Do, 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 do,
honestly, I love yogurt so much. Mm. We're at that part of our lives where uh, we can peel back the burrito because we're hitting halfway. Add some hot sauce. I was thinking about sriracha. Oh. Girl, this stuff is good. I feel like it's like a type of sriracha. Dude, I was thinking about getting sriracha, guys. Look, homegirl was prepared. But this stuff tastes good. All right, it's just a little bit on there. See what it tastes like. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Really good. Mm-hmm. Really good. I love it. I like this place a lot. I gotta tell my husband about it. He's not here with us today. He went to go visit his family. I want him to spend time with his family. Mm. Shorma, shor shorma, shorma, shorma. I love shorma, shorma. Let's eat it. I don't know what countries have shorma. I think it's a Mediterranean food. Mm. So um, I think it's a street food. Mmm. 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 I think it's mint in there. Oh, it's drizzling on me. Mmm. We're gonna look at progress. It's like below the size of my phone now. How much I eat? So good. So, so good. Talk to me. All right. Mmm. Mm. I just love the yogurt, the tomatoes, the pickled onions in there. So good. All right, let's try this sauce. I'm not really sure what this sauce is. Cilantro jalapeno. Let's try it out. Ooh, ooh. Oh, okay. You don't really taste the jalapeno, it just like burns in the back a little bit. Hmm. I think the dill and the regular yogurt was my favorite and the spicy sauce. Oh, what was that called? Spicy. It was like fire something, but it was good. I liked it. Mm. But like all falafels, it is a little dry. So you have to eat it with the yogurt and all the vegetables. Mm. Very good. I have to say though, kind of like the bowl a little more. Mm. I think it's because I typically eat my chipotle like this. Regardless, it's delicious. I'm gonna put my yogurt and just it on here. Now I know why they give you the option to like have so many sauces. I was like, do I need that much sauce? And now I'm a reformed woman. Now I know. You need that much sauce, girl. You need it. Mmm. Mmm. Was that mint? No, that was just lettuce. But it was refreshing. I think there was like something with mint in here. Mmm. 
like it wet and wild in here. Your girl loves sauce. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't know what it is, but it's so good. I know it's just like probably just a salad, but oh my gosh, it was so good. So good. And who knew salad and fries was really good? It's even in here too, the salad and the fries. Can you see a fry right there? It's delicious. Oh, but I'm so full. What am I gonna do with all this? I'll have to eat it again for tomorrow. <laughs> Today, I don't wanna eat it again. Oh, I'm so full. But guys, remember what I said about fiber, right? I got this at HEB. It's really good. The fiber is really chewy. And the reason why I like this one, they only have alcohol sugar. I think they have like xylitol or something as a sugar, but I appreciate the sugar-free option. And then look at how chewy these gummies are, look. It's like little to no effort. You can even like push it with your pinky. Hmm. I don't think I'll have a fiber issue, but when I don't have like straight up fiber that I know, I don't think fiber is in lettuce very much. So when I'm unsure, I just take it. I take it with that meal that I'm unsure of the fiber content. Because when you eat foods that don't have fiber, sometimes it can ferment in your belly, making your farts stink like kimchi. Okay, I love kimchi, but nobody want to have farts smelling like kimchi. They're going to be like, oh my God, he's ghosty. <laughs> Guys, I literally watched 13 going on 30, white chicks, just go with it. And it was just like, I was just on the movie marathon on Hulu and I caught up with the Kardashians too. I was like, bang, it's good. I don't know why I gave up Hulu in the first place, but it was good catching up. I was like binge watching everything, catching up with all the things I didn't watch. And I was like thinking to myself, oh my gosh. The old movies back then, I feel like we're so like, fun and entertaining. I really want some coffee. I can't wait <laughs> to see my husband again. I miss him so much. So good. I really like the salad. It's so refreshing. I think there's some lime in there or lemon. It's good. Mm. I think what it is is <clears throat> the meat is really good, but I don't find myself to be like a crazy meat eater. And that's why I'm like, when I get bits of the salad, the uh, yogurt, I'm like, oh yes, so good. And then when I get bits of the meat, it's good, but then it's like, I get tired of eating meat for more than a couple of bites, you know? Cause it's drying. I think I like to eat things wet. <laughs> wet eater. <laughs> oh my gosh. I can't wait for my husband to see this. Oh. He's back at home already. Huh. That's it for today, guys. I'll see you guys next time.